Hey guys, it's Elise and welcome to today's lower body Tabata HIIT workout. Today we'll be focusing on working that cardiovascular system while also strengthening our lower body with a variety of different dynamic and explosive exercises. No equipment is required for today's workout other than yourself, a mat and a bottle of water. So make sure your body's nice and warm and let's get started. Alright, so for today we're going to be working with our usual Tabata intervals. So we have three sets that we're going to get through today. We have 30 seconds on of work and then 10 seconds off of active rest or recovery. Now for today's workout, I have opted to wear some running shoes. Usually I do all of my at-home workouts in bare feet, but due to the fact that there are some options for some jumping exercises in this workout, I've opted to have that extra further ado, let's get started. We are going to face forward here and I want you to take a nice wide V position, pointing your toes outward. We have one sumo squat to a heel lift and then we're rising back up, only working to that left side to start. Here we go. So taking it down, lift your heel and rise up. It's really focusing here on rising onto the ball of that left foot, sending those knees out to either side, Keeping the back long, the core engaged, your eyes up. And as you come up to straighten, really squeeze those inner thighs and squeeze your glutes. Last one here. Beautiful. Meet me at the back of your mat. So a little bit more explosive. We have a jump squat forward, quick feet back, or a nice big step forward, quick feet back. Here we go. So option for jump squat forward. And quick feet back, or low impact, big step forward, drop it, and then quick feet. Good, so try to land as softly as you can on those feet. Weight is in the heels, really don't be afraid to drop that booty down. Beautiful, facing forward. Active rest, active recovery. Sumo squat, right heel lifts this time. Here we go. Drop, lift the heel, and rise. Toes are turned out. Allowing yourself to drop that center of gravity down to the floor. Slightly sticking that booty out. Finding that big sumo squat. Breathing through it. Good. Knee at the back of your mat. Same deal. Jump squat forward or a big step to a squat and then shuffle it back. Here we go. Remember to listen to your body, but choose the option that's going to challenge you today. The goal of Tabata with HIT is to really get that heart rate up and work at your max effort during these 30 second intervals. Good. Quick little rest here, little step touch, little skip, little jog on the spot. Open those legs back up. Lift your left heel, sumo squat. Lift and rise. It's really great balance in this set between working the cardiovascular system and working that strength and endurance. Get super low on the sumos. Drop, quick feet. 
push it last 10 seconds.
set. Lunges, left foot back. Here we go. Lunge to kick. Now if you have a wall at home, you can always do this next to the wall for balance. Otherwise, arms up to the side, on your hips, through heart center, whatever feels good for you. Keep those hips nice and square. Good. Facing forward, a little step touch. Squat to snowboard jump, or a little pivot, by tapping that foot forward, low impact. Here we go. Good, so make sure that twist is really coming from the torso, from the hips, rather than trying to twist that knee. That's so good. Lunge, come back in, leg left. 
So your right leg here essentially should never be bent. Really allow that left leg to take the weight of your body and bend the knee and push your booty back. your advantage. Last few here, make them count.
All right, starting to narrow those step touches a little bit. Coming into a little static pull down here. Let's stretch out those quads. Right leg, grab a hold of your heel. Grab a hold to a chair or wall if you need for balance, or just bring your arm out to the side. You're gonna fix your gaze on a point on the floor. From here, you're gonna take that same right leg, cross it over to a figure four, and begin to just sit back. Working through that figure four if you're a form of stretch. Excellent, and release. Other side. Grab a hold of your left heel. Bring it up in towards your glutes. Go ahead and take that leg, cross it, and sit back. So we'll sit in back into a little chair. And rise up. Shake it out. Take those feet nice and wide. Toes turned out. Promise we don't have any more squats. We're going to take it down. Hands are going to come to the top of the thighs, just gently rocking side to side here. Keeping the chest lifted. And stretching out a little bit through the back by bringing one shoulder down at a time, finding a little tiny twist. Excellent. Coming back through center, rising up, heel toe those feet in. Let's take three breaths together. Inhale, reach up nice and tall. Exhale, push it away. Inhale, reach up tall. Exhale, push it away. Last big breath in. Exhale, push it away. Give yourself a nice big sweaty hug. Thank you so, so much for joining me for sticking through that entire workout. If you enjoyed, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already.